All right, people, Mike Salden here again. Welcome back to another Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth video. Uh, today, just doing some of the can quest. This is the hard mission, uh, trying to get an S rank on it. Uh, to be honest, all of the can quest uh, missions are all pretty easy, even the hard one. Um, but yeah, I thought I would just make this video anyway because I'm really enjoying the game and I wanted to talk about it, uh, about, about it a bit more and uh, just uh, say how much I'm enjoying it and it's basically like there's five games within this one game <laughs> it's kind of crazy what RGG Studio have done here uh, like there's an entire Pokemon League or like a parody of a Pokemon League in this game there's an entire Animal Crossing Island which I've barely touched because it got too overwhelming and I was like oh my god there's just like a third game in this game um, and now I'm in like the later chapters um, and I'm playing as Kiru back in Yokohama um, but yeah I'm just doing a lot of side stuff now and the can quest uh, mission on hard just trying to get the S rank that's just what I'm doing at the moment uh, again not too difficult uh, the hard one is the only one where you might fail to get like an S rank the first time you do it but you'll probably still get an A rank as long as you aren't getting like run down by the other can collectors they're really the only people that can cause you a real problem in this um, but as long as you have a bottle of boost and you sort of keep one ready for when you're about to bang into or when one of them is about to bang into you uh, you can sort of protect yourself using the boost and take them out and get their cans as well again basically the same mini game that was in uh, the original like a dragon uh, uh, Yakuza 7 like a dragon as it was called the names are getting kind of confusing in this series at this point um, but I'm glad they sort of just swapped to like a dragon now and they're probably gonna do like just subtitles from now on like a dragon infinite wealth and then like a dragon slightly less wealth probably knowing uh, Ichiban he's probably gonna lose all his money by the time the third like a dragon Ichiban game comes out uh, he's got a good way of becoming homeless and losing his money in each game so yeah we'll see how that goes but again really enjoying this game uh, it's one of the best RPGs I've ever played and it might actually be RGG Studios best game which like at the rate they've been going at the amount of games they've been putting out that they're still each new game can be considered a contender for their best game is just really impressive so yeah thanks for watching people and i'll see you again next time with some more like a dragon